Alright guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video. Um, I guess we should start talking about this. So, the worldwide download celebration is coming up, um, pretty soon. In a couple of weeks. Uh, we should know, I believe, what the theme is of the celebration. I think it's August 17th, the last two years. Um, <clears throat> they have teased what the actual celebration was going to be on Twitter. Uh, two years ago, they showed uh, Majin Buu's ball, right? Which eventually led into Vegito and Buhan. And then last year, they showed uh, the spaceship uh, that Krillin, Gohan, and Bulma traveled to Namekin, which, of course, ended up being uh, Super Saiyan Goku and Full Power Freezer, right? So let's take a look. So the last three years, right, uh, we had Gohan versus Cell, then we had Vegito versus Buhan, and then we had... Uh, you know, Namek Goku versus Frieza. So, I mean, that is, you know, basically three arcs in a row, just in kind of a weird order, right? You know, because, you know, it goes Namek Saga into the Cell Saga into Boo Saga. But this was not the end of the Boo Saga, right? There's still many fights to happen after this. Whereas these two, this is the climax of the Namek Saga, and then this is the climax, of course, of the Cell Saga. Um, the year before Gohan and Cell was transforming Goku and Frieza, which don't really fit in, like, any arc or anything like that. They're, the blue and golden Frieza attacks are from the Tournament of Power, like, right before the Tournament of Power starts. But, like, Frieza's on, like, movie bosses and stuff. Like, it's just weird, right? Then the year before that was Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and Omega Shenron. So this is actually going to be the, what, sixth worldwide that is celebrated between both Global and JP, right? So they've now done this um, a lot, right? They've done this many years in a row. Okay, so now we can start talking about what the worldwide celebration could be. Um, I think that there's still potentially a lot of options. and we could. Just, I pulled up a, a number of fights right here. We could just take a look at them. Uh, maybe we could rank them by how likely. Now, Gogeta versus Broly. Um, they've used Gogeta Blue a lot, for sure, right? Including, I mean, he's sort of one of the anniversary units, kinda. Um, but Broly has gotten nothing since his initial unit, the Dual Dokkan Fest, at the end of 2018. I, I have to imagine this Broly as a Dokkan Fest, like, it has to be coming. I, like, this is a popular character, this Broly, that could sell, for sure. So, I would not be shocked if this is it. We don't, at the moment, have a standalone blue Gogeta or full power Super Saiyan Broly. So, that's definitely something that could happen at some point, right? Here, let me just go ahead and get rid of these three right here. Uh, next pulled up. So, uh, a lot of people have been wondering if we could get Gohan and Broly from uh, movie 10. It's movie 10, yeah, yeah. Because uh, the first Broly movie is movie 8. The BoJack movie is movie 9. And then this is uh, movie 10 right here. Um, I saw some people thinking that this could be it. Um, based, it's it's just based off of the Videl from this movie had her assets updated. Now, I, the Gohan from this movie is not super hype, but Broly. I listen. You could give me Broly, bruh. That's okay. <laughs> we're we're gonna take Dragon Ball Z Broly, Dragon Ball Super Broly. Uh, Broly is a Giga Chad. He is hype. I will gladly take uh, a dual Dokkan Fest that has Broly in it. Oh, I actually don't have it pulled up, but actually one more we could pull up too. I would love this um, as a uh, dual Dokkan Fest as well. Uh, let me see. Let me pull this up real fast. I do think this is one we probably eventually will see as well. So Super Saiyan Goku versus Broly. This right here, right? Um, I think that's something we could potentially see. I, I do, I do. Uh, them, like, they're not stupid. Broly is a big-time seller, right? So, like, that could happen, right? Um, next, we have Kid Goku versus Demon King Piccolo. I think this would be a tremendous one myself. I, I, this is probably maybe, like, my... Well, okay. Uh, okay, okay. I think, in terms of what I would want to see, I think I'd probably put this third. 
um, Kid Goku versus Demon King Piccolo. We all know the story. Goresh has told us that, you know, the anniversary at the time, the most successful Dokkan celebration ever, um, LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, LR Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, right? The very next Dokkan Fest is Kid Goku, and Japanese players were in the, the replies to the Twitter post saying this should have been the anniversary, so... Uh, you do want to keep that in mind, right? Um, that uh, excitement is always uh, very high, I think. for I-, I think this would be received well, Kid Goku versus Demon King Piccolo. And it could be one of those things where people will say, like, oh, thank God I could save my stones, and then the animations come out and they're going crazy, right? I think this would be cool. Um, next, we have God, Goku, and Beerus. Now, people are con- like. God Goku is now one of these characters where, like, it's like nearly every Dokkan Fest, people are like, I think God Goku's next. And it's like, sure, man. Like, I, I, this is not something I'm the the biggest fan of ever. And more so that I just feel like Battle of Gods, outside of God, Goku, and Beerus, you've got almost nothing to work with. I mean, you have that, the uh, Rage Vegeta. I guess you could drop a Super Saiyan 3 Goku, right? Um, you know, I, Ultimate Gohan. Currently, there is no Ultimate Gohan um, on the movie hero uh, category, right? And he does appear in the Harutagarn movie, the Dragon Fist one. Uh, he's in Battle of Gods. And then, of course, Ultimate Gohan is also in the new movie, uh, which we'll get to. I, But, I mean, I don't... We'll get to that in a second. Uh, but God, Goku, and Beerus, right? Sure, could happen. But, like, a whole celebration centered around Battle of Gods? I don't know. I, 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 don't, I don't know if we'll see that. Uh, next we have Super Saiyan Goku versus Cooler. I, I would really like Cooler. This is a crazy image, okay? I would really like Cooler as a Dokkan Fest LR. Um, one thing is, no matter what, I really need, uh, the, like, villain to be insane. And we need so many, like, leader skills for villains. It's crazy. What Dokkan has been doing is... They've been dropping. Oh, by the way, I, I actually forgot one other obvious one. I'm gonna have to pull up in a second. I'm a I'm a damn goofball. Um, but uh, Dokkan, they've been making these um, what you call it? Um, these 200% leader skills very very limited. I think on purpose, right, to sort of extend the the lifespan of it. So like. Ginyu has terrifying conquerors, right, in his leader skill, but that doesn't mean characters like Golden Frieza and Full Power Frieza or Bojack are at their best on Ginyu's, te- Ginyu's team. They're not, right? They, they, a lot of those characters don't work that well with Ginyu, the leader, who you're going to have two of, and then with Ginyu, you're going to want Raccoon and Goldo and Verder and Jason, and all of a sudden, you got the whole team made around Ginyu, right? So, they do that intentionally, very obvious to me. Um, so... We need, like, a powerful 200% leader. Cooler could be, like, movie bosses and transformation boost, right? 170%. Or maybe transformation boost could be the 200%, right? Maybe he does, like, movie bosses and something else, right? Like, I, Cooler, I think, could be an awesome 200% lead. Um, while I, I, The thing about this, though, is while I think the dual Dokkan Fest would be good... Just like Battle of Gods, it's not like the cooler movie is going to sustain it unless they would then, you know, make the celebration around, like, both cooler movies. So maybe, like, the part two LRs could be, like, an LR Metal Cooler and then, like, an LR Super Saiyan Goku and Vegeta. I think that I think people would agree that would work, right? So the dual Dokkan Fest would be Super Saiyan Goku and Final Form Cooler and then the, the top Legendary Summon Banner could be Metal Cooler and then a Goku and Vegeta. I think that would be really sick, right? So the celebration would be based around both, um... Uh, movies, both cooler movies. You could do that. I think that would work. Uh, I need to pull this one. I actually forgot to pull this up. Super Saiyan 4, Goku, and Baby. Now, last year, it, it seems like they were dropping breadcrumbs uh, that it might be related to Gohan vs. Cell, right? Android saw Cell Saga, and ended up just being Namek Saga kind of out of nowhere. So, I, I would say that any sort of hints or theories or nothing, there's not really anything guaranteed um, that I've seen, right, there is that, we saw, like, a mysterious ad, which was LR Super Saiyan 4 Goku and LR Baby, so you do want to keep that in mind, like, if that ad ends up being real, then Super Saiyan 4 Goku could be it, um, people can say whatever they want to, I've seen a lot of people saying, like, this is a, a boring one, a snooze fest, Baby needs a Dokkan Fest. He's one of the, like, biggest characters that doesn't have one. He would be a disgusting 200% lead for a lot of villain characters, right? 
And Super Saiyan 4 Goku, this is one of those things, it gets announced, it's Baby Saga, everyone is crying. Oh, boo-hoo. Those animations drop for Goku, and no one says shit again. I promise you, that's exactly what happened. Uh, uh, Super Saiyan 4 Goku, his intro could be, like, Great Ape transforming into Super Saiyan 4, and, like, it would be fire. It would be incredible, so... Um, I would have, I, I, I would see no issue. This is fine with me. And they're, they're unlike, you know, some of these movies like Battle of Gods, there's not a lot for them to pull from here. This is, you know, an entire like saga. They can pull a lot of stuff from this. There's a lot of, like, there's not really a, is there even a fat boo from GT in, in the game? I don't think so. Right. You can, GT fat boo. We can get a better Majub card, right? Like there's, there's a lot of stuff they could do. Um, from the baby saga, right? I don't think we have a GT Piccolo either who does show up and fights uh, baby Gohan. So, like, that's, you know, I, I do think this would be fine. Um, Gohan versus Bojack, I think, would be an exceptional one. Uh, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan has not had his Dokkan event updated since the 2019 Gohan vs. Cell Dual Dokkan Fest, so that would be fire. This Gohan, I like... He, his LR was really cool on release, but he got power crept fast. I would love for this Gohan to have another raw character, although they did really take that, pretty much all of his good animations. But I wanted to throw this out. This is a possibility, right? Super Saiyan 2 Gohan versus Bojack. Same thing with some of these other movie choices, though, is it's like... They don't really have too much to pull from. I mean, Trunks is pretty raw from the movie, but, like, you know... What are they going to drop a Super Saiyan Vegeta? We just got a Super Saiyan Vegeta as a banner unit for um, Golden Week, right? So it's hard to say for sure, but I felt like this is worth at least mentioning. Uh, Goku versus Jiren seems very possible to me. Something like a like a revive UI Goku into Master UI or something like that. Now, keep in mind that Ultra Instinct Sign Goku, there is a lot to pull from him in terms of good animations. The original Dokkan Fest, his animations are awful, right? Um, the LR STR UI Goku works, but that's only from the Kefla fight. The two UI Goku versus Jiren fights don't have good animations, right? Jiren is pretty underrepresented for how powerful he is. Both Jiren and Broly, I, I, I need both of them to get, like, top five characters in the game. Both of them deserve it, both Jiren and Broly. And, again, a lot of people can... You know, they'll put on the waterworks, but, you know, UI Goku is a, is a big-time seller, right? He'll 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 bring in the success. And turn a power-type celebration, I think, would work well. Um, I think Vegito Blue versus Samasu is something we could see. I know they've always done Vegito and Rose, but honestly, that doesn't make any damn sense, right? They could easily just do Vegito and Zamasu. I know we just got an LR Zamasu, but they could easily do, like... The dual Dokkan Fest would be like a, a Goku Black and Zamasu, and then like a blue Goku and blue Vegeta. Bam. Very easy to do. Um, and then, you know, th that would create another powerful partner for the Fusion Zamasu Goku Black team. Remember, they don't have a 200%. Goku Black characters are not on a 200%, right? LR Fusion Zamasu is because he's on Battle of Fate, but Goku Black characters. Uh, besides, like, the int transforming one who has, who's on Kamehameha, they're not on 200% leader skills. So, we do need another, like, you know, this would be great. Uh, again, people will put on the waterworks for this one as well, but those animations drop and people would love it, for sure. Um, This is probably my second pick that I would really love. I think Kid Goku versus Demon King Piccolo would be number three. This is the second one I probably would want most. I feel like they could do a lot of interesting stuff with Goku and uh, Piccolo Jr. here. This would be a crazy one. I don't know what they would do for the top legendary summon. Certainly, they could drop, you know, just Piccolo Jr. as, you know, sort of like um, the, a Dokkan Fest. And then for the dual Dokkan Fest, they could do giant Piccolo Jr., right? Like, they could easily do that. Um, but I, I would... This, this is like the best fight in Dragon Ball, right? Like, this this is up there with, like, Gogeta and Broly and Gohan and Cell and stuff like that. This fight is raw. This fight is crazy, man. So I would absolutely love to see this fight be brought uh, to justice. That would be so sick. Um, this, I think, is very highly likely. Um, this Spirit Bomb by Goku, right? This whole, like, iconic thing. 
uh, is not in the game in, in good animations, right? You have the thousand day login Goku, but I mean, dude, that unit came out in 2017, right? Like this deserves it. And then Kid Buu not having an LR is a huge meme. I think this is potentially another one people would cry over, but like the animations would be fire. This would work. They could easily do this. I know some people would say, oh, they just did a Boo Saga Worldwide. Well, yeah, dude, they did a GT anniversary, and then they followed up with a GT anniversary two years later, right? Like, they could do this. Nothing's stopping them. Uh, Gohan vs. Cell is something they could always go back to. The other reason Gohan vs. Cell could work well is because it could build us up potentially to Gohan vs. Cell Max and Superhero. Now, I this, the number one... Banners we could get, I think, for Worldwide would be Superhero. Gohan Beast. Yes, sir. But here's the thing. Uh, we are not going to see uh, the movie for Worldwide, unfortunately. Um, we're going to have to stick to one of these up here. So it's like, if I had what I wanted, we'd get Gohan Beast for Worldwide. But uh, it's not happening. So let me know which one of these you guys would like to see. I don't... I imagine it's probably one of these in here. I mean, what is something else it could be that I didn't pull up? I, I don't know. Like, I, it's I don't. It's not gonna be Goku versus Frieza because they just did that last year. Um, I I guess it they could do Goku versus Vegeta from the Saiyan Saga. Uh, it's it's po that it's possible. It's it's not a zero percent chance. Um, I doubt they do Super Saiyan four Goku versus Super Seventeen. Probably not. <laughs> I don't. I I'm not. I don't think we'd we'd see that. Gogeta vs. Omega? I, I guess I would... Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta vs. Omega would be fine with me. Um, there is still, I think, quite a bit they could pull from the Shadow Dragon Saga, too. That is something that they could do. Uh, let me know what you guys would like to see from the Worldwide Celebration. Again, I believe we'll know... I think I think the day is the 17th is the day we will know. Um, they'll, they should tweet out the teaser. So let me know what you guys think uh, about what you want to see for Worldwide Thanks, guys, for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.